Welcome back. Welcome back. So, you know, sometimes you go to like a place like Value Village or some other thrift store that you might be in your area, and you see tons of useless mice because usually they somebody stole them or forgotten to take the uh, receiver and put it back in the mouse. So you got a receiverless mouse. Well, this one is one of those ones that is not receiver needed because it has it's an MX Master Mouse. It has the unifier and it also does Bluetooth. And it has three different positions. Let me just see if I can just turn this on here. There we go. And it indicates what it from interacting with my computer. So it has three different types of um, settings. So you could actually hook this thing up to like three different devices, like your computer, maybe your laptop, and maybe, you know, uh, I don't know, smartphone, I guess, I don't know. So three different devices anyway. And you could actually connect that, and then you could just like switch between them by pressing that little button on the bottom, which is kind of cool. So I don't know. I thought this was a pretty cool mouse for $2.99 at Value Village. I don't know why it was so cheap, and I was thinking, well, is it because the maybe the battery shot, right? But you know what? I got it, and I brought it to work, and I connected it to my computer using the, I used the unifier. That is that symbol with, like, it looks like a star. And the other one looks like wires or something. That's the Bluetooth. I guess it's sort of in a B shape. Um, yeah. Anyway, um, yeah. So this thing, yeah. So I, I charge her up. I've been using it for about a week now. And I'll show you something about it. Just turn it on here. See this on the side. Use it for a week, and it's now at two lights. So I don't know. I don't know how long this thing's gonna last. It's a good question. Like, will it last a week? Well, it's gonna last in a week. I think it'll last two weeks, and it'll last three weeks, and it'll last a month. That could be why this thing ended up being um, something that was only you know, $2.99. But it's got these like side scroll wheels, and it's got back and forth buttons. I don't know if you can see them. Let's see, let's see if I can position this here. There you go. So you can see an, a backward and forward button. Back, backward, forward. Yeah. yeah, and then it's got the infinite scroll wheel. So it just again goes and goes, and then oh, it's, I gotta have it to work. It doesn't only only work on its power. There we go. So let's do it again. Infinite scroll wheel. Or cool, watch this, if you need to kind of get it to spin, it's ratcheting, it'll actually ratchet and spin. So you can kind of leave it on this one if you need to do. I use this if I'm doing scroll, um, like long spreadsheets or long web pages or long lists of things in different, in different uh, web pages. Sometimes there's like long lists or some of my applications that I use have long, long lists of clients and stuff like that. So, um, or expenses, for example, you might have a thousand different expenses and you gotta scroll down through all this big list. Um, and sometimes there isn't a simple way to do that depending on the software. So that's pretty cool. So oh, see, it's indicating, oh, I have two, two charge lights left. I'm hoping that it's just, it, I, I'm hoping the battery lasts. I suspect that might've been why it was like 299. Add value village. It has this button tick down here and nobody can knows about it, but you press it and it actually like kind of creates a, but you can program it, but you can have it kind of bring up like multiple pages or like pop up what's, what's running on your computer. And uh, yeah, this thing got a nice shape. It fits, let's put my hand out kind of too close. Look at this thing, it fits perfectly right in my hand. It doesn't get more comfortable than that, does it? So there you go, guys. That's 
my five minute video on a two, three dollar mouse I picked up. Very, very happy with it so far. But again, like I said, only used it for a week and so far it's only got two bars. So might have to charge it every three weeks or something, eh? but who knows, I'll find out. I use it for eight hours every day or more. So I wouldn't be surprised if I'm wearing it down, wearing down the battery, but I don't know what the original charge would, would have been like. I'm thinking, you know, even if I had to charge this once a month or once every couple of weeks, it's doable. I could, I could use it. And it's, you know, it's not a lot nicer than the, this guy here. This is a nice mouse, but, and I can always use this one while the other one is charging because this one works fine. And it's unifying, so you know what that means. That means I can actually, uh, turn on. Uh, I can actually uh, use both of these at once. So like when one's charging, the other one's usable and I don't have to like set it up or anything. They're both, both are usable. You wouldn't use them at both at the same time, obviously, but you know, just, convenience so there you go guys that's my little blurb oops knocking things over knocking things over while i'm putting away the other mouse sorry about that so that's my little blurb about a cool very cool two two <laughs> no 2.99 yeah 2.99 canadian so what is that us 50 cents Hey guys, 